Hi, it's Chen Chen here. And for today's topic, we're going to continue to talk about the books of Millionaire Rick State Minister. And for today's topic, there's Gary Keller came out a lot of myth that a lot of people face and something about compounding your success. So I'll try to make it a simple way to explain it for you. That outside there, because there's a, some of people's that they think that they don't need to be an investor or they just simply can rely uh, rely on their job they say they can rely on the income from their job so they can withstand their help then they rely on the 401k epf like that to sustain their life for for their early life and actually f from the study here for gary keller said actually there's a lot of even athlete or artists they earn a lot of money before but after they stop working then they fell into debt because they lack of financial education then they go bankruptcy so we need to face it the simple way so i want to try to explain for you is that we need to prepare for the future also even though you need some some someone will say that they don't need money or everything else or they say they already buy some insurance so insurance can support everything else is like that but actually we need to do some investment also because maybe not only us but the, our surrounding that people we love one we need to protect them also so i don't i don't want to try to make it more complicated way to explain it for you because like what Albert Einstein said that if you if we cannot explain it to the six-year-old kid which means we don't understand it also so i try to make a simple way for you to understand about investing in real estate okay now today try to go and imagine for the old school method like uh, old people they will try to talk with us is you, you need to keep the woods before it's raining day like before for all all year uh, for a long time ago a lot of people they use wood to burn the fire and then to cool to keep them warm up right so for some people normal normally they will keep the wood first then after raining it comes maybe they they have wood can burn but for some other people they always go and play just don't think about the future then when got wood they burn it up they use it up and then they don't keep any woods after raining days then they get stuck and they get cold so this is normal way that a lot of people they old people they will tell us about this but in more and one way that we can learn from what story is because some people during the days then they will keep the wood also but they'll try to plant the tree they'll try to learn to plant the tree so they will find the seed and then they plant the tree after that the tree will slowly and then go up it's like investment also for investing in real estate for some people that they start small but slowly step by step go ahead and then can generate passive income for you it's like we planting the tree also so for some people they will keep the wood then they will plant the tree when it's raining then come they still have the wood but they also have tree and then the tree maybe can give give them some fruit also you can eat also but for people there are two types of people for one people there's they have a lot of time but they lack of money so they they can go and plant their tree themselves and what about for people who already have money but they don't know how to plant the tree so there's two types maybe you can use your money hire other people to come and help you to plant the tree the people is very experienced they can plant the tree for you so in more and one way we can cooperate so when you think about investing maybe some a lot of people they're thinking about real estate investing they think it's too complicated or maybe it's a timing thing that's actually it's a myth for them so actually for real estate investing if you want to learn actually you can learn it you don't need to be very expert on something else but you can be know the generals and then know the numbers numbers and actually it's for a simple case example for you is that, that 
uh, from generator one people then he earn a money and then he go to do the study and then he help by others people who are, have experience help me then he buy a land the land for that time he buy he buy it is under value after five years the the price go out then he can sell because in real estate investing there's a lot of time we can do it not just for people who want to buy and then rent the property so every month they can get a passive income but for some people they want to flip the property they want to buy under value after that when various price out they sell it even though land also can do like that for some people they think uh, during the financial crisis for some people they sell their rent in a cheaper price so they can buy it first then keep it keep it after five years ten years the price go up then they sell it or for people who is developer is more much much more better because for developer they will buy the land and then build and then sell the home for you then this can actually a lot of successful cash uh, case not even in america but in china also a lot of people they from early age they buy the land then after that got people want to develop there so they buy their rent so they become rich there's a lot of example case for other people they can do it so you also can do it just you need to learn it step by step go ahead and then you can be successful in the future so it's something like you plant a tree you don't need a very expert on it you can use money the more benefit things for real estate is you can leverage on it not really for real estate investing you can leverage which means you can lend you can loan from bank you can buy it it's not like maybe some others uh, experience thing that for bank they only lend money for you to buy the property why not because even though if you lost the the worst case the property is still there all right so but the main point we need to do is we need to compound our money it's better than we just keep it our money is like that so maybe you put into on something that can be generate cash flow and then the value will go out in the future then you support you for your future not only from you and for your people who you love also all right that's very simple for you to understand it if you want to know more or if you don't understand what about you can comment below or text me then i'll explain it for you all right see you to the next video bye Love you.